Welcome back to the channel guys, it's your boy Wolf Nari here And today we have something a little bit different We have an anime recommendation And so, this is one of my first time actually doing something like this So if you want to see more, like, comment, and subscribe But I digress And so, today we're here to talk about Hajime no Ippo Also known as the Fighting Spirit um, Created by G.O.G. Morikata And also, the anime was produced by Team Madhouse it was produced in the early 2000s so some of the animation you may think is outdated but even for its time for its time it was amazing even now it still holds the candle and so I digress again the story is about a boy named Ipo Makanouji who is the son to a single mother who is a widow his father his father died in an accident in which he trades his social life in order to help his mother with the fishing business so he literally has no social life people invite him to go do things but because of that initial responsibility to his mother he was unable to be able to actually attend to those type of events with friends or classmates as I, you should say in this matter and so this leads him to more of a, like a life of solitude he was more of an outcast um gets bullied a lot and one day during the time he was actually getting beat up by one of his bullies the boy the goat the man himself the legend the champion takamori appeared before ipo he pretty much defeated the bullies uh without laying hands on the bullies but beat up the bullies which is weird and then leads Ipo to the boxing gym in which he starts to see amateur and professional boxers uh, like working out together. He seemingly falls in love uh, with the sport of boxing. And so that's one of the main things about Jimmy no Ippo. Um, his love for boxing actually carries the entire series because it clashes with other people's ideas, their views on boxing. Um, and sometimes a, a, a clash in ideas is what you need in in anime or manga and so Hajime no Ippo is like a sports slice of life comedy ish type of anime but when I say when they get down to the action they get down to the action the comedy hits nine times out of ten the slice of life stuff hits nine times out of ten because Ippo he is a shy boy so when you're young you don't have that confidence you know what I'm saying to talk to that girl you like then your Epo, I'm just saying, because eventually Epo does get the the uh, confidence to talk to her, but it's, it's still that awkwardness. Epo is socially awkward because of the, he had to spend most of his time with his mom. Um, so he, the guys tend to bully him like the other guys did, but this one's more and out of love than actually, um, pretty much to torture him or to make fun of him. Except Takamura, Takamura is a is a is a butt muncher, but. Anyway, another thing that's great about Hajime no Ippo, like I said, is the animation. The the fight scenes are fluid. Um, when you when someone moves or somebody throws a punch, you hear literally the sound of the impact of the punch. If the if bones break, you hear literally the sound of bones cracking. The angle of the punch. Um, they got little moments where they show the inside of the body, so you you get little um inside into boxing as well like for example one of the main characters he has a move a couple of the main characters have moves that's derived from boxing i don't want to say the move because it kind of spoils the series for you um so yes you can actually check the accuracy of the moves used in boxing and how they explain it and see because everyone owns google but oh, not owns Google, but everyone has the access to Google, so you can just look it up to see how accurate it is. And nine times out of ten, it's definitely accurate. But you know, you they gotta put the little anime spin on to make it extra. And so when they make it, when they do make it extra, it's amazing. Now let's get into the the OST, the music for it. It hits every time. Openings hits every time. Closings hits every time. During the fights, hits every time. When you when you hear, it's one moment. It's one moment because the, the the character, the, the main character has a theme. When you hear the theme playing, you know it's about to get real. But it's one moment. The theme starts to play, and then it happens. The theme just stops, and that's like one of the greatest moments to me. And Jimmy, know it was just that key little thing 
um, in regards to the, the key little detail in regards to the music as well. Because when you get used to something, then you hear it, and then it just stops. Then, oh my goodness, I, I don't even know how to explain This is like one of those animes I literally watch once a year. Um, I'm like 800 chapter deep in the 1300 chapter manga. Um, so if I ever catch up, I may do reactions to it. I, I, I don't know. But... I digress again for the third time in this video. I'm j I'm just saying niggas niggas is digressing a lot. And so one of my personal favorite boxers in the show I want to talk about is my boy Warwick. Um, like I said, everyone has their own reasons for boxing. Um, you meet a lot of boxers from different countries, in which Warwick is actually from Russia. He's a boxer from Russia. Um, he, his mother is really sick, so he needs the money uh, to actually take care of his ill mother. Um, and so he pretty much does that the entire time. Um, however, it's key moments in his character development uh, where it actually changes his aspect on why he, he boxes. Because you, you have to understand, you can you can make money in a multitude of the ways, um, but he pretty much chose to go the boxing route itself. And the reason why he chose to go the boxing route is one of the reasons why he continues to box. It, it sounds weird. It, it sounds weird. His motivation is different. He chose the box because if his motivation to choose the box, look, his motivation was his mother, right? He chose the box because of his mother. But through that, he gained an, a deeper meaning to boxing, which is his own personal meaning besides his mother because he's doing it for someone else. So, so he, internally, he felt empty, but boxing began to fill that void and he, he wondered why. And so now, the Jimmy No Ippo is definitely a, a 10 out of 10 anime, comedy, hits, OST hits, action, hits, everything hits, I'm just saying, it's been your boy Wolf Noir, let me know what you think of content like this, if you want me to do more anime recommendations, I'll do them, just let me know down below, like, comment, and subscribe, it's been your boy Wolf Noir again, and I'm out.